Good morning, children. Today we will study chapter number five about scratching the tiger back, which is a well-known poem by K. K. N. Daruwala. The tiger is a wild animal and it is in fame for its ferocity. It is a fearful animal and makes us frightened by its appearance. But it is quite unfortunate there are times when the tigers and to relax and lie down in the ground will not roam around and pounce on other animals at that tactile his mood varies with meals. When he is fed well, he is happy and relaxed. He will lie down on the ground and may ask us to scratch his back. As the winter sun becomes soft and soothing, the tiger becomes calm and quiet. By the autumn evening, within the brief moment of the setting sunlight, the poet wants us not to think of the tiger with fear because he will be resting on some river bank. The dream of the tiger will equally be a pleasant one. Its hide will no more symbolize the black and golden daggers. On the other hand, it will seem soft and polite in its attitude. The tiger will not charge at us and disturb our sleep. It will no more be a symbol of ferocity showing its wildness pouncing at us. The poet rather says that the tiger will assure his well-being and a happy mood as he was being fed well. He will extend a hand of friendship towards human beings and will tell us that he is happy and also a creation of God like us. Children, here the tiger wants to describe the identity as the co existence of good and bad evil. He says that he is as well created by God as human beings and both good and evil resides in him.
थैंक यू नाउ राइट डाउन सम वोकैबलरी रिटेन ऑन द बोर्ड इन योर नोटबुक राइट right. 